Hey, good morning. I hope you guys are having a great day or at least getting ready for a good one. This last week and a half has been very interesting for me. I got a call last Monday from somebody saying, hey, I want to put on a local GO team here in San Jose to help distribute uh, $3 million to low-income families who've gotten behind on their rent or maybe they've caught COVID and uh, they need a living wage so that they don't become homeless. And uh, I got to tell you, my initial response was, wow, that's really cool. But wow, you're going to make me leave my house in the morning? Wow, you're going to um, make me leave my warm garage where I'm where I'm officing right now uh, to go help other people? And it, it showed me internally, like, I really don't like change, even for an amazing cause. But uh, I quickly got over myself. I started talking to Penny, my wife, and I started talking to Pastor Scott. And both of them were super excited about uh, setting me free, really, from the church for the next three weeks to help pull this GO team off. We have almost 30 volunteers. They're going to try to get 800 people uh, here in San Jose uh, funds so that they can pay their rent. And that has been super exciting. I think one of the things that keeps um, coming to me, back to me, is that in Acts chapter 2, uh, the people of the church came together to help one another. And there's a lot of people in our community right now that are struggling, especially as we have this latest shutdown. So um, I'm super stoked, thankful to the church that they've set me free. What you see behind me is a bunch of laptops, monitors, keyboards, and so on, so that tomorrow and Friday and all of the next several weeks until the end of the year, uh, we can have a ton of people coming through getting their documentation, processing that, and then getting money to their landlord so that uh, they don't become homeless. How amazing is it to kind of beat the cycle, right? So um, here's my uh, kind of my devotion for us, and that is that right now, today, these days, um, we need to look outside of ourselves. There are so many needs in our community. God has given us a kingdom that we are to build up. And I know this season is uncomfortable. I know it's difficult. I know it's challenging. But we are still the church and we are still building God's kingdom despite the challenges. And so uh, pray for us. We've got 30 people who want to show the love of Jesus to people in our community that are going to be serving here. And uh, so pray for us. Pray for health. Uh, pray for distribution. Uh, these are government plans and programs, and so uh, that brings its own set of challenges, too. So uh, super grateful that I get to be part of this and part of a team that's going to help keep people in their homes through the holiday season and into next year. So hope you're having a great day, and uh, would covet your prayers right now. Talk to you later.